Hey y'all, it's Sheree, what's up? Back with another video. In this video, we'll be doing a skincare haul. I did recently upload a natural hair slash body care haul. So if you haven't seen that video, definitely check it out right here. But this video is gonna all be about the skin, the face, my money maker right here. But if you are new here and you've never seen my face, but you like my face, definitely be sure to subscribe so you can stick around and give this video a thumbs up. It goes such a long way to support my channel. And it's a lot. It's a lot over here. But if you see anything that you want to pick up, clicking the links and purchasing through my links really does help my channel. It keeps this content coming. If you're going to run out to Target to get it anyway, click the link, do an in-store pickup or drive up. And I'll love you forever. One more thing before we get into it. Let me know your favorite products. Let me know what you've been loving on. What you've been picking up. What you want to pick up. What's on your wish list. Let me know of anything that you see today. That you have tried and you love. You have tried and you hate it. Or you want to try. Anyway, now for real. Let's get into it. We're going to start off with two products that I picked up from Salvana. It's only two because most of my Salvana haul was actually body products. Like I said, I do have a previous body care video that you can check out in the cards as well as down below. So two things for my face. First of all, I have the Revectin Skin Essentials Conditioning Cleanser. All the peeps in the K-beauty community really does hype this product so I wanted to test it out. My preference is either a gel cleanser, which is what this is, something that looks just like it sounds like a gel without stripping the skin. You know, you can have gel cleansers that are really stripping on the skin, but I like gel, gel cleansers that leave the skin feeling soft, but cleans and gets everything off my face. I've said this in many videos, but I do want to make it clear and say it in this video, is that if you want to save money on K-Beauty, so that's Laneige, SK2, um, Casa X, whatever mainstream brand, mainstream Asian brand has made it to the American market, if you use a site like Stalvana, you can save 50-60% off. For instance, the CosRx Snail Mucin is $20 at Ulta, but it's always around $10 on Stalvana. That's 50% off. You can save $10 per item. And if you buy 10 items, that's $100, y'all. So much savings. The SK2 is like $100 cheaper on Salvana. So definitely check out Salvana. I also have a coupon code. It is M10, something like that. I'll leave it on the screen. But if you want Asian beauty, it's always cheaper getting it directly from Asia. It takes two weeks to come to the U.S. It's always upcharged for the American market. So just bear that in mind. So got this i also got the matcha hydrating foam cleanser i don't remember the texture of this but people say again it has the consistency that i like but it doesn't strip the skin and has matcha in it you know matcha is just great for the skin so i'll definitely report back like i do always on what i think about this i go through a lot of cleanser i wash my face twice a day and i do a double cleanse an all cleanser first and then a traditional cleanser so I go through cleansers really fast Desium the parent brand of the ordinary which is one of my favorite drugstore brands had a 23% off sale a few weeks ago I posted about it here on YouTube on the community tab I also posted about it in my exclusive community the insider tea if you didn't see it on YouTube that's YouTube fault. I tried to tell y'all about it and you may want to join the insider tea where I post all the sales and deals and all of that so you don't miss them and you save a lot of money. So join the insider tea if you want the deals and the discounts and the sales because YouTube really doesn't show content like it used to and you may be missing really good deals. The ordinary is already affordable but 23% on top of that that is a steal my friend so I picked up from Desium the ordinary the buffet copper peptides 1% I've heard really good things about this so I did want to pick it up this is supposed to be something that you can use in place of vitamin C to give you some of the similar benefits of vitamin C I heard the girls them said so that's why I picked it up this is what it looks like I don't want to open it up but it's a blue color 
and I can't wait to try this. I will definitely let you know. Something I had to pick up was not one, not two, but five Neod pumps. So I actually love, love, love the Neod pumps. I have a Neod pump on one of my oils. I like using this mostly for my skincare. You know, usually skincare comes with, this is a two ounce, two ounce uh, dropper, but let's just say it was a one ounce dropper and it's kind of gross, it has product in it. It's okay, I don't use this anymore. Um, you know, it usually comes with usually comes with these. I don't like these. I prefer having the pumps. It just makes it easier. I don't have to keep opening up the product and exposing it to air and pollutants and stuff like that. I just literally pump my products out, my oils, my serums, whatever, and I can just rub it onto my skin, rub it onto my face, and it's just a much more enjoyable experience. So get you some pumps, and they're really affordable, like two dollars. Highly recommend them. Obviously, I love them. I bought backups. I think I have like six already in my stash. I don't know. I just have this feeling that one day they're not going to sell them or they're going to really increase the price on them. So I just stocked up. I don't know. Maybe I'm crazy like people that's hoarding toilet paper and rice right now, but I had, I had to. The next items are items that were actually sent to me in PR. They were gifted to me by a bunch of different brands. And that is a blessing to get PR and be able to try products and review them for you. So I thank all of these brands in advance. The first brand is CeraVe. If y'all don't know, I did go on a brand trip with CeraVe um, last month, back in June. If you haven't seen that video, you can definitely check it out right here. And it was my first brand trip ever as an influencer. I've been creating content online for a long ass time. And this was the first brand that reached out to me and wanted to take me on a trip. That was really dope of CeraVe and they will definitely forever be in my heart. Even before I went on the brand trip, I raved about CeraVe products on my social media. So definitely an organic type of situation. But no long talking. Let's jump into it. Let's start off with the cleansers. I have tons of different cleansers to try. Some I've tried before, some I haven't. So let's talk about it. I don't think it's available in stores yet, but they have, you know, teased this product. This is their makeup remover cleansing balm. So you don't know anything about me and my skincare routine. I live, I live for a cleansing balm. I do do a double cleanse. I use a cleansing balm or my cell water when I'm being lazy, but mostly, a cleansing balm at night followed up by a traditional cleanser I have two of them I'm really happy I've already started I've already started using this I used it once and what I've noticed about it is that it actually feels like you don't need to like follow up with a cleanser like I apply it like I, I do my cleansing bombs rubbing into my face and when I wash my face like the makeup is gone I'm still going to follow up with a cleanser because that is my routine but this is so good so far. Again, I've only used it once. Even though it really cleans the face, it doesn't strip the skin. I should have been testing this more. So when it comes out, my review will be with the first on YouTube. And my video can go viral and I can be famous. J JK. But I, sh I need to keep testing this. Especially for the launch, I can really give you my honest thoughts. To see if it's worth going out and picking up. So I got that. This is another newer product. It's either on the market or coming out soon. This is their Comforted Eye Makeup Remover. I don't really wear much eye makeup. I literally just put like blush or bronzer on my eyelids when I call it a day. I'm lazy as hell. But I do have it and I'll see how it works for the days that I actually do wear eyeshadow or to see how it removes this makeup on my face, like my mascara and stuff like that. So, of course, I'll let y'all know. A product that I know and love is their Hydrating Cream to Foam Cleanser. It looks like this. I actually mentioned this product in my current favorites video, my May and June favorites. If you haven't seen that video, highly recommend you check it out right here for this product as well as a bunch of others. I love this product. I picked it up with my own money. So I'm glad I do have a backup because I'm already halfway through the one that I bought. So the answer is yes. Hell yes. Love this. So much this is a product that I've used and love on my channel as well this is the foaming facial cleanser I use this to remove my makeup I mostly use it at night it has more of a it's not going to strip your skin but it's definitely going to clean your skin more than the the cream to foam or definitely the hydrating cleanser from CeraVe so I actually love this I had a little mini size like a three ounce that I went through so I'm happy to have this because I like using this in my nighttime routine, so 
have a big one and I'm happy. I have two renewing salicylic acid cleansers. These are good for acne to treat texture and all of that. So I'm happy to have two of them. I've never tried this product, but I plan to use it where I have acne or I have texture on my back, the back of my thighs, my inner thighs, just from naturally doing women things and walking. So I do want to see how this helps to clear my acne and texture and all of that. And I'll definitely report back and let y'all know. I also have two other products that can treat acne from CeraVe. I have the acne control cleanser which contains 2% salicylic acid if you are somebody that suffers from acne I thankfully don't suffer from acne but I do get acne every now and again like a lot of people acne does not discriminate it affects all of us and I do get you know periodic acne and I plan to use this on on the times that I do have acne but again on the places that I have acne which is on my back I do have acne on my back so I plan to use this on my face and body you can use face products on your body you can use body products on your face usually body products are cheaper than face products so bear that in mind but yes also I have the acne foaming cream cleanser which has 4% benzoyl peroxide which is, at least in the CeraVe line, the strongest of acne fighting products. So first you'll have the SA cleanser, then you'll have the acne foaming cleanser, and th then this is the strongest. Speaking of body, I have two products for my body. These should have been included in my body haul, but I think I guess I forgot about them. The first one is the salicylic acid or SA body wash for rough and bumpy skin gonna use it like I use the others this has been formulated for the body I'm not sure how similar the ingredients are to the cleanser for the face but I will figure that out later and report back in a future video also I got the SA cream for rough and bumpy skin I plan to use these together to see how they help with the you know the texture and stuff on my skin I do have the topical slather but you're supposed to use that like two to three times a week. So in between time, I'm going to use this. So I'll alternate between the topical slather and the SA cream from CeraVe. This is probably the product that I'm most excited to try. This is their hydrating toner for normal to dry skin. I've heard so many good things about this toner and I love me a toner moment. Toners are definitely not necessary in your skincare routine, but for me it just helps with with that glow, the hydration in the skin, giving that look, giving that youthful look to the skin. I love a good toner and again I've heard good things so I'll definitely let y'all know maybe I'll do a CeraVe uh, skincare routine or trying Cer CeraVe for a month if that's something that you want to see definitely let me know I know CeraVe had a moment uh, like two or three years ago and that time may have passed but maybe that's something y'all be interested in for those of you who want more an affordable skincare routine so definitely let me know down below I also got their AM facial moisturizing lotion with SPF 30 personally for me I do not use moisturizers in the morning I use sunscreen as a moisturizer or I just skip the moisturizing step because a lot of sunscreens already feel moisturizing a lot of people think that a moisturizer with SPF is not as strong as something that's formulated as an SPF here's the thing as long as you use enough to cover your face to protect your face it's going to give you the same protection as regular sunscreen as long as you're using a fourth to a half a teaspoon every two hours you're going to get the same effect so I don't really like America sunscreens and I really stick to Asian sunscreens, but we'll try this out and see what it does. They also have a mineral sunscreen that's supposed to be sheer tint. It is SPF 30. I'm going to do a video on physical sunscreens, probably on Instagram. I definitely plan to do a reel that doesn't make it here. So if you are not following me on Instagram, I definitely recommend that you do because it's just easier to, you know, churn out content on Instagram than it is YouTube. So I'll report back somewhere on the internet about this because I'm curious 
And lastly from CeraVe is their healing ointment, which I've loved and raved about on my channel. I mentioned this in my favorites for January and February. If you haven't seen that video, you can definitely check it out right here. Love this stuff. I actually asked them to send this to me because the one I have, it's almost gone and I don't deserve that. If you have a rash on your skin or you overdid it with exfoliants and retinol, just plop this prop this whatever the word is on your skin and it's actually going to heal your skin if you have dry cracked lips i recommended this in that previous video and i told someone to pick this up for their lips she, she said she doesn't have chapped lips anymore you can use it on those cracked heels in summer and your sandals don't deserve that so definitely try this out for all of your situations with your skin on your body and on your face let's move on to two skincare tools because you know of course products help but tools can also go a long way i have two tools here from derma flash the first being the derma pore which is a pore extractor and serum infuser so i actually got a facial yesterday and sis was getting my blackheads but in between my facials which is probably going to be every two months i do plan to use this i'm not going to use it every night and i don't even think they recommend it i'm going to try to use it once a week i don't know how how often they recommend using it but I'll definitely look more into it I've seen a lot of good things about it and that's why I wanted to try it out and I just want to have clear beautiful skin so thank you derma flash for sending this over they also sent me over their Lux plus so sis someone actually stole this off my porch if you have no idea what I'm talking about you can check out my video where I talk about it here they actually sent me another one after that person stole my shit so thank you so much derma flash this is their sonic derma plating and peach fuzz removal it's a fancy schmancy face shaver and i deserve that even though i do laser hair removal on my face i still have to shave in between my sessions i'm on the eighth session now more on that later but yes i do have her and I will be using her and I'll let y'all know what I think. Let's talk about the only black owned products that I'm going to talk about today. And that is the brand Hyper Skin. I have their vitamin C serum. I live for vitamin C. When I'm being good to my skin and myself, I do use vitamin C every morning and vitamin c is just great for helping to lift up the hyperpigmentation giving you a glow like vitamin c is just good for the skin like that glow to my skin it's some highlighter but it's that vitamin c too also the fade and glow aha mask i can't use exfoliants on my skin for the next few days because of my facial but as soon as the time has come where I can use exfoliants again, I'm definitely going to whip her out. I'm excited, okay? I can't wait to use this. Let's talk about the brand that has one of my favorite cleansers, and it is Youth to the People. And the cleanser is a kale and green tea superfood vitamin cleanser. I've talked about this multiple times on my channel, but most notably, most notably, <laughs> in my products that are overhyped but worth the money, this is overhyped. I know a few people that don't like this, so it has so much hype on social media, but it's worth it. It feels so good on the skin, cleans the skin, makes the skin look radiant without stripping the moisture. I've gone to two sample sizes, so I'm happy to have the big one, and the answer is always yes. The Super Berry Dream Cleansing Balm. I have so many cleansing balms. It's one of my favorite parts of my skincare routine, and I've heard really good things about this one, so I can't wait to try it. If you have tried this, definitely let me know what you think. I probably won't dip into this for a good minute because I have like eight cleansing balms open right now, and I can't, I cannot open another one. But as soon as I use up somebody, it's time to pull her out. I can't wait. The Super Berry Hydrate and Glow Dream Mask. I wanted to get a mask that had hydration. I was actually able to pick these products from Youth to the People, and these are the ones that I picked. I picked this because I have a lot of clay masks and things that are, you know, that are geared around uh, pore tightening and pore clearing. I wanted something that's going to give moisture and hydration to my skin, so I did want to pick this up. I didn't realize it was so small, but it is Youth to the People, so we know Youth to the People is a little pretty penny, so. 
it is what it is I also got the triple peptide and cactus oasis serum I've heard good things about this for moisturizing the skin it is small but I hope it's mighty because it is you know it's like $60 for one ounce I do need a hydration serum I've used up all the others I'm going through my skincare so I know this seems like a lot but I go through my skincare I do have a few products from Elemis Elemis was kind enough to send me some products they followed me on Instagram and wanted to send me some products and I said why not um, I didn't actually ask for any of these products they did not send me anything I asked for yet again but it's okay I am grateful the first thing is the dynamic resurfacing facial pads I haven't heard anybody talk about these hopefully these are better or similar to the ones from dr. Dennis Gross um, so we'll see what I think about these I'll definitely report back because those pads are I have I think I have one more pad from the my sample pack from the Sephora sale so I will be whipping this out as soon as that one is finished. I got their Pro Collagen Marine Cream. I have way too many moisturizers open right now, and I only use moisturizers in my daytime, in my nighttime skincare routine. So I probably won't open this one up for a while, but I am excited to eventually try it out. I also got a facial oil from them. This is their Superfood facial oil I don't really use oils in my facial routine or my skincare routine but I will test this one out and definitely report back and last by no means least I have a bunch of sunscreens that were sent to me by Stalvana I should have probably put these earlier in the video sunscreen is the most important part of a skincare routine you can skip all the other steps but you cannot skip sunscreen of course there's the popular sunscreens from Cosr X and Isentry and Neogen but Salvana wanted to send me some new ones. So I was like, sure, I would like to try new sunscreens that people aren't talking about. Maybe I can find a gem, you know, amongst the pack. So the first one is from Derma E. This is their everyday sunblock. It is huge. It is this 200 mils of sunscreen, 200 mils of sunscreen, which is about seven ounces. You, you can't come across seven ounces of sunscreen. So hopefully I love this because for the price, I think it's like $10. It's like mad affordable and you get so much product. So I'll definitely report back and let y'all know because like I said before, we have to smother on sunscreen to get that protection. So your girl will definitely let y'all know. Access Y Complete No Stress Physical Sunscreen. This stresses me out already because let's be clear money people in Asia don't really look like me so a physical sunscreen is probably going to be Casper white this is probably something that I'm going to have to use in my house and my house alone but we're gonna see we're gonna see how it works we're gonna see the safe recipe panthenol and ceramide SPF 50 it's a cute little box I don't really want to open it up because there's just so many products and we would be here all day but I do have this sunscreen farm stay oil free UV defense sun cream I just love the packaging it's so cute so cute um, I will get to these sooner than later because I'm getting low on a lot of my sunscreens I've been eating through my sunscreens. Perfect timing, Salvana. Perfect timing. The Frutia Ultra UV Shield Sun Essence. Hopefully, I like this as much as I like other essences that I've tried. The Thank You Farmer Shimmer Sun Essence. That kind of worries me a little bit because sometimes shimmer products can pill on your body and on your face. So we'll see what I think about this one. I'm not sure I don't really have high hopes for it but we will see and lastly for something that I plan to use to reapply my sunscreen is the cynic enjoy super active airy sun stick I've heard really good things about this but I don't think I've heard anything from someone that's like my complexion someone that's black or has dark skin so we'll see how this ends up working on my skin Whew! Well, that is all y'all these are all of my skincare products I know it's excessive and I know it's a lot but this is my job this is what I'm called to do and I will definitely use these products and try them out and let you know what I think I go through my skincare I go through my products for those of you who have watched this long ass video and have stuck it out to the end this is going to be a secret giveaway so we're not going to give it away in the comments or anything like that it's just for y'all who have gotten to this 
part of the video. This is going to be my 100k giveaway. I reached 100k like centuries ago at this point and I never did a giveaway so I'm going to put it at the end of this video this is going to be for my ride or dies people that watch all of my content even my non niche content I know for sure y'all got me and y'all support me and y'all deserve this to win this giveaway it's really simple I'm not gonna make you jump through any ridiculous hoops all you have to do is one be a subscriber of course you have to support my channel to win this giveaway Two, give the video a like give it a thumbs up super simple doesn't cost you a dime three comment anything that you want but don't mention anything about a giveaway mention the products that you want to try uh, what you love about my channel when you what you want to see more of anything like that just just a general comment that's fine and then four click the link in the description box to actually enter your email just so I can email you if you win and just so we don't give it away in the comment section because people love to like hop around and get free shit and don't watch the content that's not happening this is for y'all that are my ride or die so i need to make sure i get your email to email you if you win and this is open to anyone across the world i will mail it to africa if i have to so this is open internationally and this giveaway is going to last for about two weeks i will leave the date right here in the video and that's it so let me show you what I'll be giving away. It is a bunch and I'm going to go, th go through it really fast because this video has been long enough. Now let me go through the things that were sent to me that I'm going to re-gift to you. Most of these things I purchased with my own money but there are a few things that were sent to me that I actually want to pay it forward and give it to y'all. The first being the CeraVe Hydrating Facial Cleanser. So you'll get one of these. You'll also get one of CeraVe's am facial moisturizing lotion i talked about this earlier i had two of them so i'm gonna give you one of them elements pro collagen cleansing balm this was actually sent to me from elements with the other elements products but i actually don't like the scent of this product i much prefer the rose one and the fragrance free one and i already have two elements cleansing balms and i have a hundred cleansing balms so i'm just going to give this to you and i hope you like it the texture is amazing Amazing. the way it works on the skin is amazing I'm just a stickler and I don't love the scent but I still think you deserve to try it it's like a $60 bomb so why not give it away to you and I hope you love it and if you don't love it send it back <laughs> <laughs> or give it away and re-gift it and pay it forward I got the curls a blueberry bliss reparative leave-in conditioner curls gave this to me and I have it I've tried it before it's not the biggest fan of it doesn't mean it's bad it's just not for me maybe you'll like it and if you don't like it again you can pay it forward so got that and lastly Hannah Sue gifted me with goddess hair I have a few goddess hairs in my stash so instead of hoarding it and having it forever I wanted to pay it forward so you can have one of them for the things I picked up that I wanted to share and made sure you have I actually have two DIYs in here for you one is my hair and body butter I do have a video on this already but I wanted to you know gift it to one of y'all uh, maybe a year ago when I asked y'all what I should give away y'all wanted DIY so I wanted to throw in two DIYs one being my hair and body butter that is a big 16 ounce you'll have it for a while as well as my Shea Amla and fenugreek caramel treatment this is an insider tea exclusive recipe that I never posted here on my channel so if you want the recipe you know what to do make sure you are part of the insider tea but one of y'all lucky people will win this product you won't get the recipe but you will get one of them it's all preserved and everything and they won't go bad on you so yeah it is a looser consistency but that's what I like and I hope you love it as much as I do so you'll be getting one of these another 16 ounce in terms of the you know pre-made hair products of course I have to give you things that I love two being from henna soup the first being the Coco Veda hair mask. I had to make sure I bought this so you could try it out. I love this so much. I've raved about it on my channel. You definitely deserve that. I hope you love it as much as I do. As well as their cleansing conditioning co-wash in the peppermint scent. One of my favorite co-washes of all time. Love this Ayurvedic co-wash so much. And I hope it works for you just as well as it works for me. The Botanica the Mender Protein Treatment. This has actually been discontinued. 
um i think i haven't seen it anywhere and it was on sale everywhere when i saw it i picked up one for myself and i picked up one for you too because i love this and i i really think your hair is going to love it and if i don't love it send it back <laughs> i had to buy you two products from kinky tresses because i love kinky tresses and i love these products first being the avocado infusion shampoo one of my top three best shampoos this is so good so moisturizing and your hair deserves this so had to get you one as well as their nourishing hair oil and oils and oil is an oil but some oils are amazing and this one is amazing you can use it on your hair you can use it on your scalp and the answer is always yes so have to make sure you had one of those i love this the packaging has changed but hopefully the products inside of it hasn't changed and you love it as much as i love it this is the castor and amla nourishing pomade from Kemet so you're gonna get one of these and last but by no means least of course I had to get you some Olaplex purchase this some Sephora this is the 8.5 fluid ounces um this is the number three I love this so much I raved about it they don't sell the big daddy anymore in Sephora but I made sure I had one for you when I picked it up and I hope you honestly love this as well and for sure, if you don't love this, you can send this back. The lastly is the Evolve Frizz Free Hair Drying Tea. I've talked about this since 2019. Love this so much for drying my hair. I wanted to make sure that you had an incomplete wash day. So, of course, you needed a t-shirt towel. But that is the end of it. That is the end of the video. Whole bunch of things in this giveaway. But y'all deserve it. Definitely enter and i'll see where the giveaway ends up somewhere around the world anyway thank you guys so much for watching that is it for now i appreciate the support i love you so much and i'll see you later peace bye y'all